Hey guys, what's going on? So, um, guess where I am? I'm in Cannon Beach, Oregon, and I'm in the hotel room. And check out what I just made. This right here is an origami flicker. It's a new flicker I just designed, and it's called a pie flicker. Just see, it's um, it's got these lines right here, and it looks like a pie or a pizza cut up. I don't care. <laughs> and this is how it flies. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right, want to learn how to fold it? Ready, set. Here goes. All right, so for this model, I'm going to use a six inch square of Kami. But you can use a sheet of printer paper cut square. So uh, let's begin white side up and let's fold in half. Try to make very precise folds and crease sharply. Okay, unfold and fold in half this way. Okay, unfold. And now fold this edge to the crease, and we're gonna pretend like we're making a fish base, but we're not. And don't fold all the way, just fold to this crease right here. Okay, like that. And now fold this edge to the crease, and again, don't fold it, just, well, don't fold the whole thing, just fold from the crease to the end. Like that. All right, now we're gonna do that three more times, so. Rotate uh, like this and fold this edge to the crease. And don't fold the whole thing, just fold to this crease right here. Alright, and now this side. And I repeat that um, on the other two sides. Alright, like that. Okay, now fold this point to this intersection. Like that, and do that three more times. Okay, just like this, this is what we got. So now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna fold this diagonally in half, and uh, don't fold the whole thing, we're just gonna reinforce these two sides. So just from here to that crease right there, and from here to there, like that and repeat on this side and the other direction. Okay, and then now rotate like this and fold this raw edge to here. And we're just gonna fold on the two sides. So just from here to here, like this, and from here to there, like that. And now repeat in this direction. Like that. Okay, and now let's make these folds right here on the corners of that octagon. Okay, and then now this is the tricky part. So we're going to kind of bring them all in at the same time. So, uh, like this, and you just have to pretty much bring them all in like this, see? And then you'll start to get something like that. Alright, let me zoom in. And then now at this point, we can just flatten all these flaps down, so I'm going to start right here, so just flatten it like this. And, and just keep doing that all the way around. Okay, like that. And now take this and fold them in the, in the other direction, like this and do that all the way around. Okay, like this. So now, if you flick with your right hand, make sure all the flaps are going this direction. So, we're gonna reverse fold them, so I'm gonna start with this one and make sure the flaps are going in this direction, if you're a right-hander. So, take it and reverse fold it. Like that. And do that all the way around. So, the second one. Like this and then continue all the way around. All right, just like this. And now our flicker is pretty much done. We just need to crease everything sharply, so just like this. Okay, like that, and just make sure it's flat. Just maybe press it against the table and make sure it's flat as possible, like this. All right, and now here's our flicker, and to make it fly a little bit better, let's just give it a little bit of curvature, like this. Or if you want it even more curved, you can use the edge of a table. 
but I'm just gonna curve it like this because I gotta get this video done. <laughs> like that. All right, and now let's see how it flies. <laughs> okay, so to fly the thing, you know the drill. It's just like an ordinary flicker, so you just hold it like this, and you just give it a good flick. You gotta find the sweet spot to make it fly well. So here goes. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna do it uh, two more times. Oh yeah. And I'm gonna do the last one with this one right here. Oh yeah. Alright, hope you guys were able to fold that, and make sure you subscribe, and let me know what you think. Alright, see you guys later.